Showers are winding down now, and some really nice weather is headed our way for uh, Thursday into Friday. Notice the leftover showers here are primarily now on the eastern shore over in Kent County. A couple of little dots on the radar screen around the immediate Baltimore Metro and down into Howard and Anne Arundel counties. But for the most part, very spotty light showers or sprinkles in the immediate Baltimore area. Here in Kent County, though, the rain's coming down a pretty good clip, looks like, from Galena over toward the uh, western sections of the county and all over parts of the bay. And that little line stretches over toward northern Delaware as well, crosses the Delaware uh, River and Bay and moves out over into southern New Jersey. So this is the most active part of the radar screen right now. But if you take a look at it, you'll see that the showers are moving from north to south. So the low pressure system has passed us by. The counterclockwise flow is dragging those showers down the shore. And as that continues, they'll move out of the region tonight and clearing sky should move in behind it. Those north to northwest winds gusting over 20 miles an hour now. Hagerstown in York, a gust of 20 down at Quantico. So pretty good brisk northwest wind beginning to drag in some of that more comfortable air we see to the north of us. 60s and 70s up there, contrast that to 85 right now at BWI Marshall. So a trend toward slightly cooler and much less humid air will get underway as this front pushes south of us tonight. Winds out of the northwest at 8 to 12. Shower chances diminish quickly early this evening. The sun sets at 832. And by tomorrow morning, we'll see lows of 60 to 65. So the front's making its way south of us now. The winds are pushing down out of the north off this area of high pressure over the northern Great Lakes. And this is going to track toward New England, keeping us looking pretty good. Thursday and I think most of Friday. Now, once that high gets out of the way, then the moisture, the humidity, it all starts to return and things will start getting unsettled again into the weekend, but at least a brief period of time with high pressure passing by that we get to enjoy some decent weather. In fact, tomorrow I think we'll see lots of sunshine from Baltimore north and west. A little cloud cover hanging on on the eastern shore and toward the coast, and maybe even a couple of leftover showers down in southern St. Mary's County tomorrow afternoon or going into tomorrow evening, but most of the state sunny to partly cloudy skies tomorrow. And again, noticeably less humid. Highs just 78 to 83 on a day when the normal high is up to 88 degrees. So nice and comfortable for this time of year with partly cloudy skies and a north breeze. Out on the bay, a small craft advisory, especially in the morning, it'll be breezy. Those winds may die down a bit in the afternoon, but waves averaging two to three feet, so a little bumpy out on the open waters of the bay. In the western Maryland mountains, we'll look for some cooler temperatures, 78 tomorrow, a little warmer Friday, partly cloudy, 83. Eastern shore, you got some rain over there now. That'll diminish tonight. Tomorrow, some sun and clouds mixed, partly cloudy skies on Friday. Coastal areas, including the Maryland and Delaware beaches, 79 and sun cloud mixed tomorrow, 81 Friday, and then turning much warmer over the weekend. In fact, you'll see that warming trend on our seven day forecast. We go from Low 80s Thursday, Friday, upper 80s Saturday, and into the 90s for a couple days on Sunday and Monday.